Hey guys, it's Miss Sarah. Um, on today's video, I thought I would teach you guys how to use picture exchange communication at home. Um, it's one of the most important things you can do for your kids um, to teach them how to appropriately ask for things um, and cut down on problem behaviors at home. Um, this is my neighbor Holton. He volunteered to be my student today and um, you guys would follow what I'm doing in the video. Um, the first thing you have to do is find a picture of something that really excites your student. Um, if you don't have a picture or a printer at home, um, you can always cut off um, labels from boxes. Uh, one of the best times to implement this at home is at meal times and have your students request different foods that they might want. Um, you always are going to start off with one picture and make sure that they're understanding what they're asking for. Um, so Holton really likes Triscuits and he is going to pick up the picture and request the Triscuit by giving the picture to me. And he is telling me I want a Triscuit. And then you would give him whatever he asked for. Um, I'll give him <laughs> um, If you have different things, you can um, set different images in front of them and have them pick what they want um, by picking up the picture and handing it to me. Uh, one of the keys with this um, type of activity is giving what we call behavior-specific praise. Um, so in instead of just saying, good job, Holton, um, you would say, good job giving me the Triscuit. You're wanting the Triscuit. Um, good job for da 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 completing what whatever you're asking them to do. Um, if you have any questions about how to implement this at home, just give me a shout. Uh, but otherwise, I hope you guys enjoy the video.